Hello, and welcome to another Art Maniacs video. I could sadly not find my earbuds today since I took them in this bag, so why am I wearing imaginary earbuds? Who cares? Oh, I'll have to get those later and whatnot. Okay, so today I'm gonna just get to it. We're gonna do some plastic bottle hat cat, uh, hacks. I added a little cozy hair. Cause it, so this one is still got drink in it, so I won't be using this particular one. I'm just drinking my fruit water, promoting the fruit water. It is super great. Um, but, you know, plastic water bottle will do, plastic bottle, plastic surface, really it doesn't have to be a plastic bottle. But if you want to make our second hack, then you may want to. Now I'm calling this Life Hacks because I did get the first idea from Life Hacks for Kids by DreamWorks TV. And this girl and she got nothing to do, got a couple of tricks for you. On a ukulele, which I actually have. Ukulele, which I actually happen to have in that case over there. What not? I know the chord for that song actually. But I have pre-cut some shapes out of my bottle. But the second one I made up, so I haven't actually done it yet, but I came up with it and theoretically it works. So what I had is I had my plastic water bottle. Use this one. I keep a lot of water with me. This is a different one than that one I just showed you guys. Um, because I get thirsty. Um, so I cut out like a little oval shape from the front, and you want to make sure that you leave enough at the bottom for like a little, like that, I don't know, that much. It doesn't have to be straight, mine is obviously not straight. I might help a little bit, maybe it won't. The light is a problem, so, we'll see. And you want to keep the cap on it and just cut like this shape out of it, maybe like that will help. And then I cut it in half the long way, so they went together like this. Like that. So it was like that, kind of. So then I cut this part off, and then I cut this part in half. So I used myself some of the knives with specific knife safeties. But you could easily do the same thing with scissors, which I happen to have here. You will need a Sharpie or a permanent marker. It doesn't have to be black, but I had a black one. So, I'm gonna be using the black one. Surprising, right? Um, so yes, I got myself a black Sharpie here. So, say, supporting breast cancer black Sharpie, so that's cool. Helpful to people. Okay, so I'm gonna make four of these. Okay, I didn't even tell you. Feather stuff. The first one's feather stuff. So I got these from Life Hacks, but if you don't watch that, then you're watching this, and mine are a little different, so we'll see. You're going to cut these in half, too, so I'm going to do that with scissors, because you probably have scissors and not exacto knives. I'm just going to cut it in half, do it up like this. Pretty simple, just in half. So now I've got four of these, and my bottle has cool texture of this rigid stuff. So, you're going to draw a feather, I guess. Now this is not going to be the end result, there's going to be more funness to this. So I'm going to draw a quick outline, and then I will show you. Really just like the oval part of the feather, not like the individual strands of the feather, because we'll get to that in a second. And it's good to do it one, do one, and then, because you might want them to all the same size, or you might not. So this is stupid glare, is what this is. Okay, this will have to do for now. It's gonna be glary because you can see, look at that, you can see me in the camera reflected, whatever. It looks cool. So I just draw this basic oval feathery shape. I'll draw the, no, I don't need to do that. Okay, so I might wanna make it bigger at some point, but that doesn't matter. So then with that, you're gonna draw like a line down the middle, yeah. Like a feather, has sort of a middle line. If you did it curved, you know, whatever. These are going to be hanging from something, so keep in mind that as well. I had a hole punch, that's helpful, but you could do it with scissors or just do what I'm going to do. So, hold on for that. So, you can do that, and then draw a line down the middle of it. Pretty simple so far. No, it's not a tattoo. Um, then you're going to draw some sections. So let me draw a few, but you can do it however you want. I'll just show you what I did. You might want to color a few of them in, which is what I'm going to do, but leave a few or all of them 
empty, so I can show you this cool thing. So I colored the top and the bottom one here, because the top is like nothing, and then this part. So then in there, you're going to do like design. So on one of them, I'm going to put polka dots. You could put like an initial from your name, or like some stripes or something. And do like a cool sort of stripey pattern or something, I don't know. So like you can see here, I just been, I put some lines and some dots in. Now let's do that last one there, um, maybe, hmm, what should I do for the last one? My ugly teeth. And my puzzle expander. Maybe I'll do circles. Circles are fun. Circle, 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 circle. So I don't really do the dots, but circles are fun and better in most ways. So yeah, whatever. You do your fancy design. And then you're gonna cut it out, people. Just cut out the whole ugliness. There's no need for a stem unless you want to put one on, which you might, which is totally fine. Like a, I don't, it's not called a stem because I don't grow plants. So like this is left to be part one because I take forever to do things. But so yeah, you're gonna do that. You're going to repeat for all of them. But let's just start with this one. So we'll just say, oh, I got all of them, and here's here's one of them done. So that's like cool. I don't know some designs and whatnot. And whatnot, if you haven't noticed that, as I say. You could do some stuff with paint. You don't have to use therapies, like I said, as long as it sticks. So next, you're going to take some yarn, which I happen to have. This bag is all yarn, right here. So, I'll pick a color. Like, this nice blue that I've got here. And I'll take a strand of it, yeah. A strand of this yarn. Doesn't matter how long, it just, it doesn't matter. So now you're going to decide which is the top, which I think was that. Yeah, looks alright. Alright, so then you could take like regular scotch tape, but I'm going to be using duct tape because I love it. That time shows on the screen. Seven minutes. Better finish this up real quick. So, I don't know. You could use glue for this, but I'm boring. You know what? Let's use glue. This I'll save this for the next thing. Let's use glue. Let's not be boring today. Let's use glue. Let's be cool people. Like the cool kids. Heard that song? No. The problem is that cool kids have problems too. I would know. I mean, really, I wouldn't, but <laughs> as a joke, cool kids have problems too. I would know. So yeah, you would try to glue that. You know, I'll 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 fix it. By the next episode, I'll have it done for you guys. So uh, that was a cool little feather thing that you can hang from whatever you want. Maybe even a dream catcher for you guys to like remember and play around with. And I guess that'll have to be it for today. So uh, I guess I'll do a few more. And bye.